The second or the fourth for the mic? Between um, what? So it can't be the third. <laughs> Did you if see it comes, my face? If it comes on the third, we're sending it back. Can't, can't do it. Hi, <laughs> Dio. Gotcha. It's so early for this. Gotcha. <laughs> okay. Oh, Lord. Okay, um, so the thing that I wanted to make sure that it got to is uh, the orders and marketing budget for October as you're going through this week. Um, I just need to make sure, like, everything is added to the October marketing budget. Okay. So, I know a good bit of stuff has already been done in there, but I just want to make sure that that gets done. If you're teaching the intermediates, it's hard for you or hard for a student to do this. Palms are flat on the floor, rotate your hips. If you don't feel any strain at all right here, this technique probably isn't quite that hard. Okay? If you're having a hard time, see how you're feeling? It's because your hips are so tight that they can't roll. Okay. Uh, first off, I wanted to uh, give a shout out to Mr. D'Angelo. Uh, last week, he um, knocked my socks off, which as a karate instructor, you're supposed to have socks off anyway, right? But anyway, uh, he knocked my socks off um, because uh, we have been discussing assistant instructor curriculum for our assistant instructors. And one of the projects that I've given to him is to develop some assistant instructor curriculum and start looking at what we need to do for onboarding people when they first come on as assistant instructor. Great job, Mr. D'Angelo. Way to work. Really good on the boss. Awesome. Good morning, ma'am. All right. Uh, other thing I thought that went really cool and re went really well uh, were the graduation ceremonies this past week. So um, great job, team, on that. I know just about everybody in here was involved in some form or fashion, whether that was, um, you know, recording it, making graphics, cutting the cake. Um, making sure that all the students got to where they need to be by answering the phones and telling them, no, don't show up on this day, come on this day. You know, everybody had a part in that, and the graduation ceremonies went really, really smooth. Awesome job on that. Give yourselves a big round of applause, everybody. You're just swatting at it like a cat would swat at something. It's just completely straight. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Try not to turn the body and then kick. Try to spin a Yes, all at the same time. Okay, boom. There it is. You have the one that's as tall as he is at home. You think so? Okay, so this is the Joe. You'll be okay for today. Yeah, I know. There's four different weapons. So this is the Joe. So you'll be okay for today, but the next time you guys come back on Monday, just you want to bring the bow staff. It'll be as tall as he is. If he doesn't have one that's at home. That's the blue one. Yep. That would be the one. We got too many weapons at my house. <laughs> <laughs> so just make sure he brings that on Mondays. Yeah. All right, take it away. What's up, guys? It's Mr. Racing from Seamless Cry Center. I want to show you your fighting combination, the first part for Noctober. Noctober. <laughs> <laughs> Nocturnal Noctober? Nocturnal. <laughs> Gonna do a little challenge right here because we used to do this instructor class. We're gonna start from the back and we're gonna come to the front. Miss Missy, you're involved too. We're gonna be giving a praise and we're going through the alphabet. We start with A. Mr. D'Angelo, give me a word for praise. Start with A. Should be super simple. Awesome. See, I knew he was gonna take it. Mr. Frankie, you've got B. Beautiful. F. 
Fantastic. Number ultimate. Three. That was the ultimate. Who says that? Fanny says that. <laughs> <laughs> You're unique. Me. Very nice. Very nice. Okay, today we're working on their new fighting combination. So it's a attention bow, guard position, explosive shuffle, jab, cross, back leg, round kick. Come to attention and bow. So it's gonna look like this. Hi! 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 Whoops, back. Hi! Like that. Hey guys, how are y'all doing? Intermediate class? Awesome. Hello. Be right with you. I want everybody to think about turning that hand instead of it being the back of the hand, turning that hand out. So you're going to do it again. Turn this hand out. Like this. Left and right side. <laughs> so right here. Come back across. Come back with a reverse stretch. Now go up. Back. Down. Up. And So when you expect something out of somebody else and then they don't fulfill it, you're feeling like, ah, they didn't do their part. And this person might be feeling like, well, I wasn't, was I supposed to do that? I had no idea I was supposed to do that, right? So it's confusing. So when you're thinking about a progress belt, I know we've had this conversation a lot. First of all, let me tell you what it's not. It's not a participation trophy. Everybody knows what that is. That's what you get for just showing up somewhere. Okay, so it's not that. Here's the best way, or another way that I've thought about laying it out. And it's going to hit everybody. So here it comes. You're here, you have a job to do. You hope that you're doing a good job. And one of the ways that you know that you're doing a job, let's say, for instance, if you were hired for job A, and we told you that when you came on as a team member at SKC, that there are going to be evaluations as you go along your journey so that we can make sure that we're doing our part to train you and you're doing your part to learn. You grab your own hand, you'll be able to go there. And then switch to the other hand. Ah, don't butterfly. It's not for my form doing all the work. So that's going to be something that you're going to see the kids doing a lot of, the students doing a lot of. It's using their arm. Yeah, get them using that wrist. Okay, we're going to pause there. Mr. Waters, can you show everybody what our Karate Bot announcement is really quick? We already went over fall uniforms. So we did this in the promo video. Um, are you good at this? I'm not good at this. Uh, I'll give one person, one volunteer. Let's see, Mr. Grayson. We can oh, do this. Mr. Grayson. We can do this. We'll battle this out. I can't. Hold on. <laughs> so part of this. Karate Bot you know, is we do Beyblades, and we battle with Beyblades. But one of the things that's really exciting is we're going to do live action Beyblades, so you're going to be a Karate Bot. you got to get your generator going. And then you gotta battle. Can Whoever is who drops first ooh, is out. Okay, you gotta reset. Okay. Can we at least use the circle ones that are not bent? Do you wanna go grab one of those grab ones? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna say three, two, one. I'm gonna say let them rip. Three, two, one. Let them rip. Turn them off. Yes. Try that again. Use your hand. Don't do it. Exactly. It works. Yeah. Three, two, one. Let them rip. <laughs> Go! Strategize for your turn. Ready? So go! So vlog, I'm back on the mat. Just went through. Here's my assistant for the first class. We're gonna have an awesome day. Fight week is this week too, so I'm gonna get, I'm sweating already, so this is great for the, the weight cut. Go get your ex Mabel stuff. So guys, that's our wrap up for today. About to get started in some classes and some teaching. I'll catch you later.